I met Michelle, she was assisting a photographer that I was hired to do styling for. And I kind of remember like this girl rocking up kind of late and her being like really pretty and stuff. But I was like, what is she doing here? She's kind of in the way. When I first met Jade, um, initially I was really scared of her because she comes across as quite cold. But as I got to know her, she's incredibly talented. I love her. She's like my best friend. I want to see my Where possible, we try and work together. If we get a freelance editorial job, I'll try and get her on photos and me on styling. When Michelle and I work together, obviously it's fun and we make sure we do something that we're both really into and really passionate about before we do it. So it means that the results are always going to be something that we're really proud of. If I had my choice, I'd, I'd always work with Jade. We've become good friends and it's just, it's just effortless. I guess we <laughs> say whatever we like to each other. We're fairly honest with each other. And we kind of read each other quite well. It's like we have some weird telepathic thing. I can kind of tell when she's like pissed off, so I just stay away. There's no need for conflict. Michelle was on a different shoot. It's obviously not as fun, but um, we just try and text each other as we go throughout the day and see who's doing what and what's happening on each other's set, and then we'll meet up at the end and have a drink. Principles I work and live by as a whole, I guess, is just don't be an asshole. Do things properly. That way you'll, you'll never regret what you've done or the outcome and you can be proud of what you've achieved because you've tried. Work hard, be kind to others and also play hard too. I like to have fun. Michelle's like a sister, but not in a gross babysitter club's way.